I've got a pretty colorful CV. Uh, I've been a long time in startup kind of world or um, let's say innovation capital world before Babel Force. And I've also worked in large, very large organizations as well as being 20 years in the startup environment. And yeah, I mean, there was a, there was a lot of things that, uh, that Christian and Timo, my co-founders and I really wanted to do quite differently. Um, one of them is that we wanted to have a company that really respects the craft of engineering. So um, I've not always had that in the past. There's a quite a lot of technology companies who either don't follow that path fully, really fully, or drift away from it over time because an organization naturally becomes more sales and marketing heavy as it goes on, regardless of how technical it is. But we wanted from the beginning and on an ongoing basis to really value that, that craft. That was one thing. Um, the other thing we wanted to do was to balance that up with all the other crafts that need to be valued in the company and create an organization that's very autonomous at the, let's say, local level. So um, I, we, we really wanted an organization where, if you imagine it, where you, you sort of, if you don't do anything for a while and then you check in with people, you know, you, you're sort of pleasantly surprised that everything runs because the people know what they're doing, they have the skills, they have the autonomy, and they can make their own way. And, and I think a third thing was we're a company who have long relationships with our customers. And that's been the history of my involvement in the customer experience and customer service industry is that you know, it's, it's a detailed area that we're in and you build relationships over a long period of time. And we're trying to provide a backbone activity to do that. So the upshot of all that is you, you really need a lot of integrity and integrity doesn't happen by accident. You have it because it's kind of baked into everything that you do, which means that our relationships with employees, with team leaders, with heads of departments, with every layer of the company, plus our engagements with everybody else on externally, they all have to be based on integrity. But I think this third area um, was was one thing that's really, really, really close to our hearts because it's easy to drift away from that. You know, as your teams expand, it gets harder and harder. So if you can't, if you can't, first of all, define, and then secondly, communicate, get that into the minds of other people, then it's going to be very, very difficult to maintain it as you grow. And luckily, we have maintained that. I think, you know, I think we have an organization that is, that really values um, and respects um, each pe each person that we deal with individually and in the organization that they're in.